Peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. First you take the peanuts and you mash them, you mash them. First you take the peanuts and you mash them, you mash them. Make peanut, peanut butter, and jelly. Peanut, peanut butter, peanut and jelly. And jelly. Hey, welcome back to our stupid reaction. It's Corbin. Oh, you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks on Patreon, phone, Twitter account, leave a bell in case you want. Oh! Follow us on person, YouTube channel, it's in the description below. Hit him so hard his nipples fell off. Oh, no! That happened in a fight once. It was terrifying. Guy got hit so hard his nipples fell on the ground. Wow. Today we're doing a kind of a tourism advertisement. They make a weird sound, too. Have you ever heard nipples fall on the floor? Yeah, it's kind of like, well, that's when you pick them up. This is called Golden Chariot, Indi India's luxury train. And I know we've done another we've one. We've done a luxury train. We've done, train. I was told, this is not the same one. Many moons ago. So this is a different one. A different luxury uh, train. It's, it's going to be SRK standing on the top going. <laughs> Who did that with him and got the rope arms around her waist? Who was that up there with him? Who was the girl doing the number with him on Chaya Chaya? She had rope burns? Yeah, apparently from keeping her up there, she had a rope tied around her to keep her from falling off the train. Oh, I don't know. Dang it, who was that? It wasn't the lead actress, was it? No, I don't think so. I think it was just the, just the, the dancer. The dancer. Anyway. Train. Any old who. Rope burn. Hold on. Shah Rukh. Going Chaya 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 Chaya. Malika Aurora is that revealed who? she bled around the waist after shooting her iconic song. Yeah, yeah so I told was, you it was Malika. Malika. You idiot. Aurora. Of course it was Malika. That goddess. Anyways, today we're doing it's kind of like a, uh, a train uh, kind of a tourism train thing. Okay. I know you guys have a lot of trains. One thing I wish we had here, even though we do have trains, we but they're do. nothing like what the, the rest of the world has. No. It really it sucks. It's, it's disappointing. Yeah. Um, I would like to take one of our trains. But it's one, they're expensive and they don't go everywhere and it takes a long time. Yeah, it's very different than say, of those of you who live in Calcutta, you have a, 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 a subway system, not too different than say in New York, although New York's is much, much bigger. We don't have anything like that here. We have a little tiny subway system. <laughs> you got diddly squat. Thanks to the car companies. Yep. In case you didn't know that, in that 19, like, 05, true. we were supposed to have, like, a big subway system installed, kind of similar to New York, because we're supposed to, because we have such a big city. Um, the car companies bought out all the plans and because they thought it would even cut the price. Anytime there has been an attempt to do some kind of a massive transit thing, which I've always said, follow what Walt Disney did, create a monorail system. It's clean energy. You could put it right in the middle of all every single freeway. Car companies will not allow it. <sighs> Anyways... This is a, a tourism video about a, a train. A golden chariot, a luxury train. Here we go. Driven by Pepe Le Pew. <laughs> when was the last time you caught a train? Because you wanted to. Long time. Not because you had to. Train travel has been synonymous with romance with stopping to smell the flowers, chugging through at a melancholy pace while you gaze That's upon gorgeous. vistas of the mellow countryside. I love the color. That's now throwing a landscape as diverse and beautiful as India. I wish we got to take a train when we were in uh, India. You get one unforgettable journey. Welcome wow. to the Golden Chariot. Meticulously planned itineraries that let you choose. Oh, it's in the south. The pride of the south and wow. the southern splendor. Wow. The Maybe pride we can do of the it. south traces its itinerary through wow. culture and natural history. Oh, it takes you to all those places. From the urban cool. metropolis of Bengaluru to the calming wilds of Kabini. From experiencing the local culture in Mysore and Hassan and you can get off. to I witnessing the saying. rich history of a 500 year old dynasty at Hampi and Badami. Oh. The trip eases off with some melancholy in the quintessential haven that is Goa. <laughs> the southern 
Film Splendor runs its itinerary through Tamil Nadu, Pondicherry, and Kerala, showcasing wow, the vibrant history and culture across this serene landscape. Departing from Bengaluru to Chennai, the trip showcases the best of the southern countryside before allowing you to experience unique cultures in every microcosm it passes through. From the churches of Chennai to ancient temples of Mahabharata, from the soulful journey at Oroville to the fun-filled beaches of Pondicherry. Explore the best of art and heritage through the culturally rich towns of Trichy, Thanjavur and Madurai. Wow. The highlight of the trip takes you to the only place in the world where you can see three oceans. Witness the magic of the first rays of the sun at the very land's end of India at Kanyakumari. Kick back at the Kokolam beach before replenishing your soul at the mesmerizing backwaters of oh, wow. Albi in Kerala. A holistic holiday that's well-rounded in awesome. every way. The route ends back in Bengaluru. The two itineraries will enrich your life with the best of South India's art, culture, history and heritage. So hop aboard for a magical journey. Check into one of the 44 well-appointed rooms complete with attached bathrooms. But that's not all. There's a business center and a gym to keep you in there you go, Rick. on the rails. <laughs> And we haven't even come to the best part yet, the food. Two restaurant cars with a state-of-the-art kitchen, which makes every dish imaginable possible. In the face fruit. of such comfort and they luxury, make fruit. in the face of the beauty of the amazing temples and heritage, it is quite the achievement that the food is a highlight for many a guest. The staff are at your beck and call, ready to cater to your every whim and fancy and make you feel like royalty while doing so. What are you waiting for? Come, rediscover the joy and romance of train journeys. Make luxurious memories on a journey upon the golden chariot. I love that music. <laughs> Did they play that on the train? <laughs> I want that behind us all the time. No, you can't don't. be in a bad mood with that music no. behind you. Uh, I do have one request. Can you update the decor of the train? I like the decor. No, I don't. I like it. It's like, you know, the, the decor of like the Buckingham Palace? I think it's hideous. Like that, that, the stuff that's like supposed to be like nice and fancy. I think it's all so ugly. Yeah, but at least it's real. It's not like the set of TBN. Who's TBN? The Trinity Broadcasting Network? I don't know what the fuck. I don't you don't know that? that? What is that? Oh, wow. Like a I don't know if it, that's... It is. <laughs> it was huge. That's, huge. That's, I don't even know if it exists anymore. Sounds terrible. Well, you know, it's exactly the same as, like, Donald Trump's living room in Trump Tower. It sounds terrible. It is. Yeah. It's awful. No, I just don't it's like gaudy. that. Gaudy. Uh, classic decor. I don't... It's supposed to be, like, fancy and... Royal. I like it in terms of... Like, for me, at Buckingham Palace, that's awesome. But when you try to make your living room look like Buckingham Palace, that's terrible. <laughs> uh, at least I there was no plastic much on the more the, the thing I would do is... And I don't know how long this is. Like, how right. long? Because, like, next time we come to India, <laughs> whenever that'll be, obviously. <laughs> can't, gotta, I, uh, there's, we, you know we can't come in? Yeah, like even if we people, people to. like, what's your next trip? Like, we literally cannot. Literally, come. <laughs> no e visas are being issued to tourists and haven't been since March of 2020. <laughs> like, we cannot come. Can't come if we want um, to. I mean, but obviously, there's stuff going on. Obviously, here and there, and so it's we have no idea. But the next time we come, we've said many times, we'll go, want to come to the, the south. south. Um, so if, if yeah, but how if, long is that's what I'm yeah, I want to know. I don't how know if it's going to take stay. up the entire time we're there. Right. But it looks like you get to see a lot of stuff on this. Do you get to actually get off? They stay for a couple hours and right, like, like a cruise, a, like, a, like a riverboat cruise where yeah. you stop at places, dock, get off. Because that would be perfect. Because there's so many things that I uh, go on to see, and you get to be on. Yeah, the but train. I wouldn't. I wouldn't want to go and just like you got two hours in Goa. I, no. Yeah. No. I want to stay in Goa. Exactly. Um, I don't want to fly Air India though. That's. The <laughs> <laughs> great thing about it, if you don't yeah. know that story, real cheap. Uh, but you that's, know, then you might be delayed. Uh, 15, Sometimes you 20 get hours. what you pay for. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> this is not a veterinarian deal. Uh, but yeah, it, like, I love the whole like getting to see a lot of oh, stuff. I love that. And on a train. So if it's yeah. like a week, that'd be awesome. I think because you, then you could see that, but then you could still go to your other places. Because obviously, um, it's gonna we're gonna come for at least two weeks, hopefully more, depending on. Uh, uh, you know, we don't know yeah, what the world's gonna look like. That, how long that? But obviously, is. we want to go to Kerala. We want to go to Goa. We want to go to Tamil. We want to go to those places. Chennai. Yeah, Chennai. There's so many different. And then there's always awesome freaking temples. Pondicherry. Yeah, those freaking awesome temples that they have yeah. that like right into the side of a cliff. And so if you guys get to see all that, it's just, I don't know, one, how expensive it is. Uh, right. Two, I don't know, like, this is, looks like a fancy tourist train. Mm -hmm. So they might charge fancy tourist prices. Right. <laughs> so. Uh, might get some sticker shock on that yeah, one. Yeah, we, uh, like when we were there, we, we stayed in Airbnbs. Uh, for, yeah, all but one place. All but one place. In Amritsar. Amritsar. Which was an awesome. A beautiful. What was it? The Taj. It was the Taj. Um, and <laughs> I looked up the Taj, we stayed in Amritsar, and I looked up the one in Mumbai. Mumbai and Mumbai is way, way more expensive. expensive. <laughs> I promise you that. We could not have afforded I the one. I guarantee. We went into the Taj we in did. Mumbai and walked around. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, like the prices were astronomically bigger. Yeah, of in, course. In well, because everybody stays at the Taj in Mumbai. Like, yeah. Barack Obama stays there. Oh, did you know what he said? Yeah, like okay. everybody, come when they come to Mumbai, they stay at the Taj. This, uh... A really nice hotel. <laughs> that wasn't bad. I, if I hear them, I can do them. Yeah. Anyways, but yeah, that was really cool. Uh, next time we're in India, we will definitely do a train. I want to make that we, a priority. And the reason you brought up Air India is because we kicked ourselves. Yeah. Oh, we for not taking the train when we were stuck. Yeah. We could have. Yeah, we got delayed uh, a full day. Uh, like literally, lost full an day. entire we, day in the airport in New Delhi. We were supposed to be like 9 a.m. We got from Amritsar and we went to Delhi and then it got delayed <laughs> like eight hours over and over and over and then and over it got over delayed over again. So we didn't get again. to Rajasthan until like 11, 11, like 11 PM. PM on the day we should have spent there. Yeah. Um, but obviously we did not know that it only takes about four and a half hours to drive. Time. Yeah. To so, drive or we could have taken a train. Could've Both would have been much faster. And the only reason we didn't is because we kept being told, oh yeah, it's going to take off at this time. And then that time rolled around. It's going to be taken off at this time. And then that time rolled around to the point where we're like, is the plane here? It's being worked on. Yeah. It anyway. Was, it was pretty bad. Um, but let us know about this one. Uh, or if we should just take one specific train Because our luggage was checked too. So <laughs> It's true. Um, next time we come. So we need to uh, want to take a train. So it should be one of these. How I expensive hope they have it bathrooms. Is. I'm assuming that would suck. They definitely have bathrooms. <laughs> Josh!